Hey everyone! So today I'm going to take you guys along our grocery shopping. We are in need of a lot of things y'all. Like the refrigerator's bare, our big freezer's bare, and our pantry is looking quite bare. <laughs> so my first stop is the meat store. So if y'all have seen my grocery haul videos before, I share that we go to a local meat and produce market about once a month and we stock up on all of our meat. I actually, I need to look back. I don't remember the last time I've I've been I think we had enough chicken that we didn't come last month okay I just pulled our last pack of meat out of our freezer for tonight's dinner so obviously it's time to majorly stock up so that's what I'm doing today is getting a ton of meat praying that they have enough chicken sometimes they don't have enough uh, meat out and we have to make another trip which I mean it's not the end of the world first world problems there but so hopefully they do so I don't have to make another trip and then throughout this weekend we will be stocking up at Walmart and Sam so I'm going to show y'all each shopping trip and each grocery haul as I get it. The best part about coming here. <laughs> we have a little ice cream stand outside. Even moms need a treat every now and then. And wow, ice cream is good. <laughs> All right, I am back home. I'm gonna show you everything that I got. So I'm just leaving the meat in the bags. I got, I think three or four of these big packs of meat. They're each two, just over two and a half pounds. So here's another big one. Here's another big one. Two more big ones. So that is three, four, five big ones. Two smaller ones. So they didn't have, they were bringing out more big ones. So I was able to snag two more off the cart. And then I got two of one and a half pounds. So that's all ground beef. Then I got chicken. So these are about close to two pounds. Some are a pound and a half pack. So some meals I use one pack, some meals I use two. No. And then I got, I believe, three, no, two packs of the big things of chicken. So I'm liking just cooking that up in the Instant Pot. So this is three pounds. Um, well, that says 2.65. The other one's three pounds. Um, I like cooking up a big lot of chicken in the Instant Pot, and then I have it for a few meals. So we got some potatoes, some feta cheese, because um, yum. I like having that in a pasta salad or a salad. Tonight we're having tater tot casserole and I'm all out of block cheese or shredded cheese. So I got that for tonight's dinner. We'll buy more tomorrow because um, that's a little bit pricier cheese. They didn't have, you know, less expensive cheese. Anyway, so the strawberries were on sale. So I got four packs of the strawberries. Blue Blackberries were also on sale. So I got two packs of those. Same with blueberries and raspberries. We got some green beans, two things of red apples and some tomatoes. Just got home from a Walmart grocery pickup order. We are in need of a lot of stuff. So our table is full. I'm going to show you everything that we got. And then I will tell you the meals that I have planned for the upcoming weeks. All right, so we will start over here. I got three gallons of milk and three of the A2 milk that one of our kids needs because the milk does not settle well on her tummy. So kind of like a snacky-ish area. I got two of the chicken and biscuit crackers. Several of our kids like those. I actually thought that I ordered the family size. It's been a while since I've done a grocery pickup order. So some things aren't <laughs> perfect, but you know. Um, got Italian dressing. Got four things of crescent rolls. We use these to make taco pockets for an easy meal one night. Got a pack of peanut butter crackers. I got a pack of Lorna Dunes. One of our daughters really likes these, so that's a snack for her. Got some Toll House crackers. Cheez-Its. I had actually ordered the yellow Cheez-Its as well, and they didn't have them, so I didn't get them. So I got four boxes of the granola bars. My homemade granola bars did not turn out that great. I'm gonna try something else soon. But in the meantime, it's been a long time since I bought these. So I got those because the kids really do like them. So I got four boxes of the chocolate chip and then two boxes of the peanut butter chocolate chip. And then Addie asked for some food dyes. 
for some baking that she wants to do. So I got that. Two things of peanut butter. And then I got four um, jars of the Hunt's pasta sauce. And then I got some pizza sauce because we're going to do homemade pizza one night. And sour cream. And then I got two, two packs of cream cheese. We use that for our chicken pot pie and another meal that I can't think of at the moment. Two packs. Yes, you can have a granola bar. Okay, so I got two packs of sliced cheese for sandwiches. I got a pack of cheese sticks, some mozzarella cheese for the homemade pizza night, and then a big block of Colby Jack cheese. I got three packs of flour. Um, I was hoping that they actually had the Walmart brand, but they didn't, so I had to get that. We have been doing more things from scratch, trying to stretch our grocery budget. So there's a lot of flour involved. Anyway, so I got some more cane sugar, some chocolate chips, again, for that baking. So I got mini chocolate chips for making muffins and then just two regular chocolate chips for cookies and stuff like that. So I did get apples yesterday. I actually ordered Granny Smith apples because the meat market, produce market that I went to yesterday did not have Granny Smith anyway. So I ordered Granny Smith at Walmart and they substituted it with Gala apples. So we have a lot of red apples, so it'll be fine. It will get eaten. Okay, so I got a squash and zucchini. I got some bananas, a big thing of broccoli, some more laundry detergent because we were almost out, y'all. That's not good in this family. Uh, six cans of pinto beans. So we are going to be having pulled pork for Addison's birthday. So I got barbecue sauce. <laughs> Addie saw this. She was like, that's a cute little baby jar. I thought it was the big jar, y'all. But it's a cute little baby jar. <laughs> okay, so pizzas for just like an easy lunch or dinner, a snack, something, you know, like that's just like quick service. Um, some white rice, actually jasmine rice. I mean, it's white, but you know, it's jasmine. <laughs> so I got four notebooks for our kids for co-op. Taylor needs it for her science class. And then Taylor, Addison, and Peyton, no, Taylor, Addison, Peyton, Jackson need it for their science classes for co-op. Um, I wasn't sure that I bought enough colored pencils whenever I bought some earlier. Each kid needs it for co-op, so I've picked up two more just in case. I mean, you know, obviously it will get you some more crayons while stuff is, you know, on the back to school sale. All right, so I got two things of Honey Nut Cheerios, two things of regular Cheerios. And then I'm about to be printing a lot, y'all, for our school. So I got a big box of copy paper. So I got eight loaves of bread. I actually ordered the Walmart brand honey wheat and we got substituted with Sarah Lee. So that's a nice thing. <laughs> Two things of buns for when we have pulled pork sandwiches. That's what Addison's birthday is coming up. And that's what she requested was pulled pork sandwiches, mashed potatoes. And what else did she say that she wanted? I don't know, I can't remember off the top of my head. Um, so I got some English muffins to make breakfast sandwiches, some popsicles. Y'all, I thought that I got the big bag of chicken nuggets. I did not. I got the small bag, so. Anyways, RB fries to go along with uh, probably the pulled pork sandwiches or, you know, just another side one night or for lunch or something. Two boxes of elbow macaroni. I got two things of stuffing. We use this for a uh, chicken stuffing casserole. And then some strawberry applesauce. I got three packs of that. And then broccoli rice and cheese casserole is a request later in the month for Logan and Harper's birthday. So I got two things of the crunchy onions. And then mom's sanity, y'all. I got some more coffee. So I got three packs of the creamy hazelnut. Okay, so I'm going to just kind of tell y'all my list of things that I'm going to be making. I'm going to try making breakfast cookies. I haven't made them before but I thought that might go over better than the granola bars that I can't get to stay together. So I need, I do need to try another recipe for granola bars, but anyways. So we are going to be having Mexican lasagna, tater tot casserole, chicken, broccoli, penne bake, um, beef noodle bake, you notice all these bakes, <laughs> pulled pork, green beans, that's what Addie wanted. So on Addison's birthday, she wanted pulled pork sandwiches, green beans, and mashed potatoes. And then we'll be having baked chicken one night. And then I actually wrote down fried chicken, but I might do kind of like a baked, I don't know. I kind of got inspired on Instagram for this fried chicken, y'all. We'll see if I actually do it. Tacos, goulash, that's why we got the elbow noodles. And then our chicken stuffing casserole, chicken pot pie, and Italian chicken. And then for Logan and Harper's birthday, it, they want broccoli, rice and cheese, casserole, and mashed potatoes. Can you tell a favorite in this house? Kinley's birthday is also in the midst. And I, I mean, she's gonna be turning two, so she doesn't really have a preference of dinner. And she really isn't, she likes fruit. 
So I was gonna say, she's not really that picky. She just eats a lot of fruit. So that's our meal plan. This is our Walmart haul tomorrow or tonight. Haven't quite decided yet. We will be going to Sam's because this isn't all y'all. So we decided to go ahead and, oh, hello. <laughs> I'm ready for my clips up. So we decided to go ahead and go to Sam's today instead of waiting until tomorrow. It is 8.46 and we are just now getting home from Sam's, but I'm gonna show you everything that we got. All right, so here's an overview of the table. So we typically go to Sam's once a month um, and then like fill-in halls, we will go to typically Walmart, sometimes public, sometimes Aldi. But this is um, just kind of a quick scan. We got two boxes of baby wipes, one big thing of uh, toilet paper. So we had dinner there, we had pizza, and we always like, that's the treat is we'll have a fountain root beer. While we're there, all the fountain drinks were gone or it, the machines were not working, so we couldn't get it. So I told the kids that we'd get a pack of root beer. So we did that, which that sounds really good right now. Got some butter. We got maple syrup, three things of cheddar cheese, um, block cheese, a thing of salsa. Sam's salsa is seriously like the best salsa. Okay, so two big packs of tortillas and one low carb tortilla. And then two packs of cucumbers. We got a thing of Elvita mac and cheese. They did not have any craft mac and cheese. This actually went up in price significantly. I was not excited about that. I wouldn't have bought it, but daddy said it was fine <laughs> so we got a thing of mandarin oranges some pizza rolls orange juice and then we got a lasagna i like to have a lasagna in the freezer it's just good to have on hand in case it's a busy night and i've got to go somewhere or something it's just a quick easy dinner on those hairy nights all you mamas know what i'm talking about okay so we got a caesar salad kit and then the southwest chop salad kit so i told the kids to pick out four bags of chips you notice that there's six? <laughs> no, for real. The kids did pick out four bags. So they picked out the Funyuns, Doritos. They picked out regular chips and the cheddar and sour cream chips. Daddy picked out these four to go with the salsa. And well, y'all, if y'all been around here for a while, you know I like my skinny pop popcorn. So I got a bag of that. And then I'm kind of excited about this, y'all. A friend of mine was telling me about these and how good they were. So I got these dark chocolate true true or true fru. I thought it was two teas. True 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 fru. Nature's strawberries with dark chocolate. I mean, yum. I actually didn't even read the ingredients, so hopefully it's all good. Well, anyways, sounds really good. Um, my older girls asked me for the dark chocolate thins, and well, I mean, who can say no to that? So I said that was fine. So we got the bacon crumbles uh, to add in our eggs for uh, breakfast sandwiches. Two cases of black beans. We got a case of ketchup and two things of bananas. Some blueberries. So those blueberries that I bought, which was only two small things um, the other day at the meat market. So that was actually two days ago are gone. So our kids eat a lot of fruit. And then we bought grapes and we ate them on the way home. Yes, we certainly did. And then some pulled pork. That is what Addison wants to have for dinner for her birthday. And some kiwi. We got one case of green beans, two bags of frozen broccoli. Okay, we have not bought Nutella in a very long time. Um, and the kids asked for that. So we got some Nutella and then some Hawaiian rolls. So that's all the grocery shopping. Like, we got it all done. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> uh, so if you guys are new here, I normally start our videos out this way. We are a large family, so it takes a lot of food to feed this crew. We are a family of 13, we have 11 children. Camden is officially eating food, so he is counted in that number now. So we also homeschool, and so all of our meals typically happen right here at this dining room table. So I wanna say thanks for hanging out with us, seeing our grocery shopping, how we managed to get it all done. We gotta get this stuff put up. Thanks so much for hanging out with us, and we'll see y'all in the next video.